A six year old boy at a St. Louis County summer camp last month has raised some serious questions. So what is the responsibility of pool owners? Fox News Vic Faust and Brown and Crouppen attorney Andrea McNary take a closer look at the issue and tonight's legal lens. Andrea, let's talk pools. What are the obligations of business owned pool owners? So swimming pool and property owners have a duty to make their properties reasonably safe. Uh, this obligation also applies to commercially owned pools, whether they're lifeguarded or non lifeguarded. Sometimes people think that if you're injured and there's a swim at your own risk sign or no lifeguard on duty sign that the owner can't be liable for any drowning is, uh, issues or near drowning. But um, there are industry standards, local regulations and ordinances that uh, property owners have to comply with. For instance, in the city, uh, there needs to be adequate uh, water clarity, lighting, um, drainage, and lifeguard equipment on site. So if one of these things aren't complied with, a owner can be liable for dangers they knew or they should have known about and that an ordinary user wouldn't have known. You said lifeguard. What kind of pools do you need a lifeguard for? It's really dependent on where you live. So for instance, in the county, if there is a enclosure, whether it's one pool or several pools, if that uh, total square feet uh, is 2,000 feet or more, there needs to be a lifeguard. And then similarly in um, the city, it's 2,500 square feet. Okay, you explained the business side. What are the obligations of private pool owners? So generally speaking, the standard of liability is lower, but any property owner has an obligation to refrain from doing anything that's actively negligent, negligent or also they have to warn uh, people that enter their property, including pools, about any dangers that they knew of and that their users or their guests wouldn't have known about. Um, in addition, depending on where you live, there can be ordinances that you have to comply with that if you don't, um, it can make liability um, if there is a uh, injury on your property. For instance, um, several jurisdictions require a fence to keep people from um, entering the pool area. Vic Faust, Fox 2 News. And you can catch The Legal Lens every Wednesday evening at 6 right here on Fox 2.